Hey everyone, it's JJ for Filmora here to empower your inner video creator and we are back with another episode of You Ask, We Answer. If you're new here, it's our series where we answer the questions in the comments section of our videos. If you aren't new here and you're returning, welcome back. So I have a bunch of questions as per usual from all of you, so thank you very much. It's in our lovely holiday basket. We got a whole bunch of questions and answer them at random, so let's go. So we have a question here from Mobile Game Studio. Can I use any solid color for chroma key instead of green? It's a great question. So usually green or blue screens are used because they are the complete opposite of skin tones. So technically you can use any color for um, your chroma key background. You just have to make sure that the object that you are using doesn't have any traces of the color that you are gonna be keying out or else you're gonna have some parts of your skin or your clothes are gonna be keyed out as well. So just to be safe, it's always good to use green or blue. We have a whole bunch of videos on green screen, which I will link in the description box below. So check that out if you wanna learn more about green or blue screens. Our next question is from Legendary Lemon. Hey JJ, can you do some Fortnite dances? Take the easiest. <laughs> also, a real question, does Filmora is suitable for gaming? All right, so um, as I mentioned in my past You Asked Me Answers, I'm not cool, so I don't really know what a Fortnite dance was, so I had to do some research. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do the floss. <laughs> okay, so from the video, I think it goes like this. Bam, bam. <laughs> Is that right? I hope that was right. Floss, I'm so flossy. Yikes, <laughs> sorry guys. <laughs> So, um, Legendary Lemon, you had a second question. Um, is Filmora suitable for gaming? So, if you mean like editing your videos, um, yeah, so you can definitely edit your gaming videos in Filmora. However, if you're um, a PC gamer and you want to record your um, gameplay, I highly recommend using Filmora Screen, which has more adjustable options if you want to record your game, yourself, and your audio. So, if you want to check that out, I will link it in the description box below so you can go ahead and give that a try. All right? All right. To our next question. <laughs> Hi, just want to ask when editing videos, particularly travel videos, is it better to choose um, a music first before editing and trimming the video to sync the beat to the music? Does Filmora have auto sync? That's a great question, and that really depends on the editor. Usually, some editors will pick the music and then cut it to match the beat of the music. However, there are some editors who want to create the structure first and then find the music that fits that structure. So it really depends on the editor, you, whatever you want to do. So Filmora does not have auto sync. However, this is a highly requested feature that our team totally knows about. So we are currently working on our next big update. So keep an eye out, keep an ear out. Just keep a lookout because we're gonna be releasing some awesome, awesome stuff coming soon. So stay tuned for that, okay? So the next question comes from Lakesh Cuddy Putty. How did you do that zoom effect? Hmm, you mean this zoom effect? <laughs> Let me show you how it's easily done in Filmora. So you have to cut your main video so that you have three clips in the part you want to zoom in. The first clip will stay the original size of the video, a wide shot. In the second clip, you'll have to zoom in to about a medium shot. You do this by selecting your clip and going to the Crop and Zoom tool. In here, zoom in enough so that the clip doesn't look like the first one. In the third clip, again, go to the Crop and Zoom and make it super close. So you should have like a sequence of like a wide shot, a middle shot, and a close-up shot. And there you go. Cool zoom effect. Uh, the next question comes from Good Leftovers. Mm. Everyone loves some good leftovers, not gonna lie. How long does it take you to edit a video? So thanks for asking. So we have an awesome video team here, as you guys know, and I asked them and it takes about one or three full days to edit a video. Although that does depend on the content of the video as well as the type of the video. So approximately one to three full days of editing. The Gamer of Games. Can you distort videos in Filmora? Yes. Let me go and show you how it's done. When you go to Filters, click on the sidebar where it says Distortion. There you can find free distortion filters to add to any of your videos. So give them a try and let me know which one you like the best, as well as if you want to show us what your video looks like with the distortion effects. Link it below because I want to see it. This question is from 
ENTV. Thanks JJ for the great tips. I would like your view on storyboarding. Do you storyboard your videos or just go for it? So thanks for your question. Um, so for our videos, it also depends on the type of video that we're doing. So for more of our epic videos, for example, our Star Wars video or our Halloween short film, what we do is as a team, we come up with a concept and then we quickly do a quick storyboard, or nothing too fancy to make sure everything is organized and that we know exactly what shots that we need to get for that video shoot. But some videos, we just kind of go for it because like the USB answer is kind of just random and fun, right? Right. Thank you guys so much for all of your questions. I love them. They're getting super creative. Make sure to keep them coming. Ask all the questions that you want us to answer in the comment section of our videos. And I want to ask you guys a question. Actually, I want to ask you two questions. One, holidays are coming. What are you looking forward to most for the holidays? And my second question, what do you guys want to see in our upcoming videos? Which ones do you like the most? Do you like our um, epic skits? Do you like um, our funny skits? Do you like our tutorials? Anything, let me know because we want to make sure that we are giving you guys the best videos that you guys want to watch. So make sure to let us know in the comment section of our videos. Woo! All right, so don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in our next video. Bye! <laughs> Bye.